Check out G2A.com for great gaming deals and use code HATTON for a discount. Hello, welcome to Hatton Games. Today I'm going to be sharing with you guys my CSGO config. If you are here to simply just download and install it, then check the description and click on the first link. If however you are looking for my explanations as to why I have certain settings as they are, then keep on watching. So first off, my rates are set to be optimal on 128 tick servers. If you do play on 64 tick matchmaking, then it will auto magically revert to that and you'll be good to go. You'd be surprised at how many players have their rates set up incorrectly, resulting in poor hit registration in game. Next up are my mouse settings. Nothing to read into here. Your sensitivity is always going to be personal preference, but I do recommend keeping it low as you're able to be more precise with long distance engagements. My video settings have a brightness of 2.2 just to give a boost in dark areas. I also have my BenQ monitor that helps me with this so I don't really have to raise it any higher. My FPS is capped at 600 and my main menu FPS is capped at 144 which is the same as my monitor's refresh rate. For audio I have the entire volume set to 0.4, music volume is enabled to 0.04 and the 10 second warning is cranked up to the maximum at 1. This allows me to hear when there is exactly 10 seconds left on the bomb while still being able to hear footsteps and other vital audio cues. My HUD has a full scale of 1, a red colour theme to go with my logo as well as the net graph values positioning it in the middle and making the font size small. The radar is set up so that it is always centred with a low scale of 0.3. This allows me to see the majority of the maps to get good info on where teammates are holding and what areas are open. My crosshair is set to pink, I've had it like this for a long long time now. Uh, for me pink stands out the most on all maps and is easy to see. Some of my more useful binds include using mouse 4 and 5 to pull out my flash and smoke grenades. This saves me from fumbling around my inventory to the right nade and gives me the right one instantly. And of course I've also got my trusty jump throw bind in there as well which is super useful to throw precise smokes across a longer distance. Uh, I haven't got any buy bind set up because I honestly don't need them. If you want to make changes to this and add them in then definitely do. I don't mind, uh, just use my config as a template for yourself and mix it up for your personal preference. If you're wondering how to install it, all you need to do is simply download the file, drag the auto exec into the CSGO config folder, which can be found through your C drive, program files, Steam, Steam apps, common, Counter-Strike Global Offensive, CSGO, and then CFG. Load up Counter-Strike and you should see in the console that the config has been launched. If you want to grab my launch commands as well, I'll leave them in the description. To input these, simply go to your Steam library, right click CSGO, click properties, set launch options, and paste them in. If you have any problems, let me know and I'll do my best to help. Have a good day and I'll see you next time.